Hi, my name's Sarah White and I'm an area controller at Swanwick. I've been valid for 20 years and I do three sectors, Daventry, London Upper and London Middle, which all are above 20,000 feet. The air traffic system is designed to work maximum capacity with lots of aeroplanes flying through so we have lots of standing operating procedures. However, at times when there's a lull in the traffic, um, evenings, quiet times, weekends, um, then what we might do is we might try and get a tactical benefit for a single aircraft um, which might be suspending a standing agreement or perhaps going more direct if we can. So an airspace improvement would be something where we can bring in something that's flight planable. So perhaps there's a direct route that we could actually make um, a proper route that's agreed by the CAA. And that gives the aircraft the double benefit of being able to fuel upload for a route that they know they're going to fly. However, there's lots of times when although we can't offer that as a fuel planning route, um, we can just do it on an ad hoc basis. Bristol inbounds from the south and the east normally have to drop to flight level 280 which is to get them um, both below the busy upper sector um, which handles a lot of transatlantic flights and also to get them underneath climbing outbounds from places like Stansted and Birmingham. However if it's quiet and there's a lull in the traffic what we can do is we can either bring them in at flight level 300 um, or even at their cruising level which means that they can stay at their optimum level for up to 40 miles longer. IFAX offers lots of protection. What can happen is that if you ask another sector to work an aircraft, they can either recognise it, which would mean that it's highlighted and would show all of the conflictions, or they can actually um, elect to work it, and in which case you can change the electronic sequence of coordination so that the next controller would have all the details and can interact with the flight fully. When I'm not working as a controller, I have a new role, which is called the 3DI focal point at Swanwick. And what this involves is raising awareness about fuel efficiency with controllers in the ops room. Um, I work with the watch supervisors, the local supervisors, and also the controllers who are talking to the aircraft. Um, one of the things I'll do is I will brief them all individually and as groups on the importance of fuel efficiency, the history of it, why it's important to the airlines, and the different things that we can do, both procedurally by bringing in more fuel efficient routes, or the tactical benefits that we can offer on an ad hoc basis when the traffic allows.